Yeah, it was bad. It's Butter Broadway along with Sweet Becca. We are here at Family Arena getting ready for Jingle Fest 2019 with our friend Blanco Brown. How are you, man? Man, I'm doing amazing. It's good to see you again. Likewise. Uh, last time you were here, you actually let us take you down to the arch. We did our best to do the get up. You got a chance. Well. Just... Got a chance to see me really perform. I mean, you you probably remember how I outshined most people around the area. <laughs> Don't stroke his ego. It's bad, and you know it. <sighs> I got moves. Blanco, Whoa. you saw the video. Well, you know, God is good. <laughs> <laughs> Might have been good to you, but it wasn't all that good to me. I ain't getting no moves. <laughs> Man, you have been incredibly busy since the last time we talked. We were just looking over a few minutes ago some of the stuff you got going on. Now you've gone and gotten yourself booked on Dick Clark's New Year's Rockin' Eve. Yes. How cool is that? Man, I watched that show forever, and... Never imagined being on it, so it's one of those things that's still surreal to me. Right? I can't wait. It's a good lineup there. That yeah, time. talk about the fact that you're going to be with Salt and Peppa. Are you going to do the one-two step with Sierra? I might. You should do it. You guys should trade. <laughs> that, that might be a good idea. That's a lot of line dancing for Paula one show. Paula Abdul, Dan and Shay. That is a big lineup. Yes. It hey, is. if Paula Abdul asks about me, don't mention Vegas. <laughs> That's fact right there. I'm done. Yeah, she will, but don't. If Paula Abdul asks about him, call me. Because <laughs> I don't believe a word of that. Yeah, Vegas he's story. being straight up. Yeah, not a word uh, of it. Yeah. I'm gonna let you know. Uh, yeah, you yeah. do that. You, you should. Do that. Lord. Well, I know, I know you've got your album, uh, Honeysuckle and Lightning Bugs, but you also are now with a song with Parmalee. We were trying to look for it online. I think it may not be out yet. Is there any chance you could give us a little feel of it? Maybe a little sample? If you want us to be Parmalee, we can. It comes out uh, December the 13th. Okay. And close. it's Real close. Just, just the way God made you. Okay. Yes, I love you just the way you are. And I just feel like we need more of that in the world. Sounds like it's going to be a I'm good in. one. Can't wait to hear it. That's I'm good in. stuff, man. Mm -hmm. Indeed. Thank you so much. I'm glad they made me a part of it. We are glad to have you here, man. This is, I mean, not that we weren't planning on having a good time anyway, but when they said Blanco Brown was coming, we got really excited. It was like, okay, now, now we're getting this thing started off right. I'm honored. <laughs> <laughs> this man was performing in our parking lot. It was. About six months ago. And every piece of equipment, this is not a lie, every piece of equipment we provided the man to do his show broke. I mean, it broke right in the middle of my man doing his thing. And he's so gifted vocally, he kept everything on. It was just perfect and amazing. And I figure if you can do that with zero equipment, tonight's show ought to be off the chain. And it was fun seeing you at the CMA, too. I meant to tell you that. Oh, One thank of the CMA you much. Awards, yeah, you I were, was in my bag. Yep, I enjoyed it. Thank well, you so I wanted much. to ask you something because he was talking about the fact that you're vocally gifted. I read an interview with you where you said your mom actually told you that you can't sing and you need to just give it up. Well, she ain't say, <laughs> see, dang, see, mama, that's I harsh. I don't know how you paraphrase that. I ain't seen that part of give up. <laughs> you just made that one up for the record. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> but usually when but your she, mama tells you you can't she, sing, that's but she probably. She did her. tell me that, um, like, I should work at it. Way more. My brothers, they were great. And me, I didn't have the confidence for it. I was doing a lot of drawing. I was doing magic tricks. And I was just into a lot more things. You know what I'm saying? I wanted to be a great singer, but I didn't know how to be. And she just used to tell me, hey, mm -mm, that ain't the right note. Mm -mm. So I just, I, I stayed quiet. I started practicing on my own. Now, how many brothers do you have? Two. And they both sing? Man, they, they look. Gifted, gifted. And what are they doing right now? My youngest brother is a songwriter. My older brother is still writing songs also. My younger brother was a signed artist, and he's written for I'm like just saying, neither one of them are booked to play Rihanna. Jingle Fest. That's all yeah. I'm saying. I, I don't know if your mama noticed that or not. Yeah. That's all I'm saying. That's an important deal. Man, look, my, my youngest brother produced the song on my album. So we keeping it all in the family. My dad produced on my album, too. Really? That's brilliant. Oh, that's awesome, yeah. man. Now, let me ask you. We talked about this last time he was here, and I know it's the same old song. You're like, man, we did this last time. I know, but it's such a great story. You got to work, or you got to. Kane Brown got to work with you to put together the first project. And now he'll be modest about it, but you actually kind of note for note worked with him on how to do each song on that first project to get the best he could out of his voice. Yeah, vocal reduction. Um, 
that's where I was. It's crazy because when I was vocal producing, I was playing some of my records for producers, and they would, you know, they would listen to them, but they'd be like, man, yeah, so when can you come back and vocal produce the next song? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and now they want to try to take credit for it. Like, no, you had nothing to do with what, where I'm at right now. <laughs> wow. You try to keep me in a corner. No sub, buddy. There you go. All you right. heard it here first, Blanco. Nobody puts Blanco in the corner. <laughs> <laughs> but did you carry a watermelon? <laughs> going to be a great time at Jingle Fest tonight with Blanco Brown. And man, thanks again for coming out and hanging with us, brother. It's always good to see you. Thank you so much. We've been practicing the dance since the last time we saw you, so hopefully we'll do a little better tonight. Mm, hey, I I hope y'all, y'all going to come out with me and do the get up? Uh, listen, I'm going to throw it out. He was lying. I sure yeah. have, man. I just, yeah. I just was supposed to yeah. say that. that was, we, we, he, we still, we I are am still done. just as white as we were the last time you saw us. You weren't supposed to call their bluff. Spud Broadway with Blanco Brown on New Country 92.3.